Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, let us see how to prepare a cost sheet. The question is on the screen. Kindly take the screenshot of the question. From the following information, prepare a cost sheet to show the following components. Prime cost, factory cost, cost of production, total cost. They have given raw materials purchased, carriage on purchases, direct wages, factory overhead, selling overhead, office overhead, sales, sale of factory scrap, opening stock of finished goods and closing stock of finished goods. Let us see how to solve this problem. This is the problem. I think by this time we are we all are aware of the format. Now first we know that always we need to take raw materials. So in question they have given raw materials purchased. First now we have to raw materials na thagolbeko question and in kotti dare raw materials purchased how much is the raw materials purchased 35,250 35,250 is the raw materials purchased the next is carriage on purchases what is this carriage on purchases now you would have bought a goods from the buyer and he will put some delivery charges for you that is carriage on purchases so you need to add carriage on purchases carriage on purchases and renu ni one angdi in the raw materials na purchase maan be kare or delivery charges na haa kirtare adu carriage on purchases how much 850 now add this 35,250 plus 850 we will get 36,100 35,250 add 36,100 rupees. Now, for this, we need to add direct wages. This is direct wages. How much is the direct wages? Direct wages is 18,450. Now, add 36,100 and 18,450. We will get 54,550. 36,100 and 18,450. Add 54,550. What is this? This is known as prime cost. Now, our first procedure is over to find out the prime cost. Next, what we need to do? We need to add all the factory overheads. Factory overheads galna idhikke naavu add maadbe kagathe. In question they have given directly factory overheads. So how much is the factory overhead? Factory overhead is 2750. Now add 54,550 plus 2750. We will get 57,300. Sale of factory scrap. They have told sale of factory scrap. So here we have to minus it from the factory overhead. Sale of factory scrap. Factory kelsak bar de ronta was to galirate. Adnella navu sale martivi. Adana ili navu minus marbe kagate. How much is it? It is 250. Now minus 250 from 57,300. We will get 57,050 rupees. 57,000. 50 rupees. What is this 57,050 rupees? It is our factory cost or work cost. It is factory or work cost. This 57,050 rupees is factory cost or work cost. Now, we found out the factory cost. The next procedure is to add all the office overhead. Now, we need to add office overhead. In question, they have given directly office overheads. How much is the office overheads? It is 1,850. Now add 50,050 rupees with 1,850. We will get 58,900. What is this 58,900? It is known as cost of production. 58,900 is the cost of production. Now, they have given opening stock of finished goods 
and closing stock of finished goods opening stock of finished goods we need to add and we need to subtract closing stock of finished goods ili opening stock of finished goods kottidare matte closing stock of finished goods na kottidare opening stock of finished goods na add maadbeku closing stock of finished goods na subtract maadbekagutte now add opening stock of finished goods opening stock of finished goods how much is the opening stock of finished goods it is 9750 now add 9750 with 58900 we will get 68650 9,750 थौसंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी मत फिफ्टी एट थौस नईन हंड्रेड ना आडा सिक्सटी एट थौसंड सिक्स हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी रुपी नमेंगे सिगते ना फॉर् दिस वि नीड टू सब्राक्ट क्लोसिंग स्टाक आफ फिनिश्ड गुड्स क्लोसिंग स्टाक आफ फिनिश्ड गुड्स क्लोसिंग स्टाक आफ फिनिश्ड गुड्स नावी सब्राक्ट मे हौ मच इज द क्लोसिंग स्टाक आफ फिनिश्ड गुड्स इट इस इलेवन थौसंड हंड्रेड It is eleven thousand hundred. Now subtract this eleven thousand hundred from sixty-eight thousand six fifty. When you subtract it, you will get fifty-seven thousand five hundred and fifty. Subtract मारोगे fifty-seven thousand five hundred and fifty से करते. This is nothing but our cost of goods sold. Cost of goods sold. Next, our last procedure is to add selling and distribution. overhead selling and distribution overhead what are our selling and distribution overheads so they have directly given in the question 2450 now add this 2450 for 57550 we will get 55100 what is this 55100 it is our cost of sales cost of sales now we know cost of sales and in question they have given us the value of sales what is the value of sales they have given the question the value of sales is 75000 we know value of sales is 75000 now it is easy for us to calculate profit to calculate profit the formula is sales minus cost of Sales, so sales value is seventy five thousand and cost of sales value is sixty thousand. So you have to minus seventy five thousand from sixty thousand. You will get fifteen thousand. So fifteen thousand there is the profit. Hope you understood this problem. So the notes for this I have put in the first comment. Kindly download the same and study well. Thank you. If you have any queries regarding today's session. kindly send your queries to education.mbbroadcast@gmail.com